Hey there gang, how you doing? Just a really quick video for you all about hiding your download page. Now it's very important when you create a product that you hide the download page because obviously you don't want people just being able to search on Google to get your product for free when you know they should be paying for it. So there's a plugin that you can get hold of. I'm here by the way in my plugins area um, of the blog itself, um, Adventures in Internet Marketing. And if we scroll down through the many many plugins that I have installed uh, by the way I should probably kind of clean this up a little bit and make uh, give myself fewer plugins to, to deal with because it can actually slow your site down if you have too many plugins and um, it's just a quick tip for you so try and keep it as, as minimal as you can um, basically don't do as I say don't do what I do which is to have too many plugins so right here uh, yes here WordPress meta robots this is the plugin that you need and you install it exactly the same way as you would normally install a plugin in WordPress um, but the one you're looking for is called WordPress Meta Robots. So you go up to the uh, plugin area here, click on add new, obviously that will take you over to the new uh, installation of, a, of, of the plugin where you can actually search for that particular plugin itself. So let's just go here, uh, WordPress Meta Robots, and make sure you type it in exactly as it is. Uh, if you type in Meta Robots, you'll find there's other plugins as well, which, in my opinion or my experience, don't work quite so well. So right here, you can see this top one, WordPress Meta Robots. Obviously, you can see I've installed it already right here, but it's by a guy called Philip Speck, and uh, yeah, created by his company Design Studio. And you can see it's got you know amazing ratings. So let me show you what it actually does inside the actual posts and pages. And by the way, this works for pages and posts alike. So uh, right here, you can see this is a post, and this is actually the post that you are probably uh, watching this video on right now. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube then obviously welcome to my channel and uh, you can click the link below and it'll take you through to this post where I share some more details with you. But uh, yeah, this is the, the post that I've, um, I'm writing right now and obviously this is the video I'm recording for it. You can see I've actually got a space there in my code for this video that I'm shooting right now to go into. But down here you can see this is where the plugin actually installs itself and it will go under here and obviously it will be labeled meta robots and it gives you a choice right here and what it gives you the choice of is well there's four things it can index it and when it says index that means that it puts it into the search engine so it allows Google to come to the site check the site over and then anything that's got the index tag in it like this one has for example can be indexed within the search engines um, anything that has no index just here means that it it can't be you know that's uh, really simple really but then it's also got these follow and no follow options as well so there's actually four configurations now for your download page what I'd suggest you do is you come down here and you go for no index and no follow now no index obviously as I said means that it won't be found in the search engines no follow means that any links that are on that page um, that, that go to outside sources which obviously if, you, if it's your download page then it's unlikely there'll be any on there but if they do then it means that none of your uh, your sort of standing if you like within Google any of your integrity goes to that page um, whereas a follow link means that it will you know a follow link um, or a follow yeah follow link from your page means that you'll get some of your your link juice if you like will go to the site that you link to um, and it will give that site credibility you know, whether it has it or not. So I suggest that you have a no follow links on most of your sites. I think most of the links on WordPress by default are no follow links anyway, so there's no real danger there. But yeah, the thing to do is make sure that you choose no index. Um, the follow or no follow is your choice, but no index is the one that's vital for your download page. So that's that. The other option as well that you've got is to come up here and go to where it says publish up here and instead of choosing it to be visible to the public you actually want to make sure that this is hidden and we can actually choose to password protect it just by clicking there and again if you enter your password in here you can then email that to the people who are uh, buyers of yours so somebody goes and they buy your, they, your product whatever it might be and they go through to a page where it collects their email address and after that then once they, you've got their email email, um, they confirm their email address and then they get sent the link to the download page along with the password. And that's your, obviously you have to set that up within your automated uh, response that you have. So within your email autoresponder, um, I use GetResponse, but you can use anything you want to really. Uh, 
uh, that has that capability. Things like Aweber. I think Mailchimp's got that that uh, capability as well. So you know any of those that you want to use, uh, you know one shopping cart as well. Any of those you can use in order to uh, you know send them the password automatically so that when they sign up they get the password to this page. So there you go. Hope that's been useful for you. Just a quick video about protecting your content really and hiding your download page. The most important thing obviously is this Meta Robots area right here. Get the Meta Robots plugin, uh, but also you can password protect the pages as well. So hope that help, hope, hope that helps is what I meant to say. Um, have a yeah, a good uh, day or good evening depending on when you're watching this and uh, obviously feel free to leave a comment below this video or indeed on the blog itself uh, depending on where you're watching this. Alright, take care, talk to you soon.